Over a million people in the UK have a significant disfigurement to their face or body. They don't all cause physical problems, but I know myself that looking different undoubtedly affects you psychologically. In Wales, 35-year-old dad of two, Dave, has spent his entire life living with a very visible birthmark. This particular birthmark is known as a venous malformation and it's caused by abnormalities in the walls of blood vessels, which prevent them from holding their shape. They fill with blood, making the veins bulge and look very dark red. In medieval Britain, we thought people with birthmarks were witches. Later, marks on babies became known as strawberry marks because we believed they were caused by what mothers ate or craved in pregnancy. Stalk marks are the most common, affecting 40% of newborns, named after the bird that's supposed to have delivered them. These eventually disappear, while venous malformations like Dave's continue to grow and darken in colour. Growing up with a birthmark has really knocked his confidence, along with trying numerous treatments with little or no success. I had injections, I had bits cut out, different things. I had uh, laser surgery, I had cryothermy. Some of those treatments were very, very painful for Dave indeed, and he didn't seem to get a lot of result. When Dave married Rebecca, the prospect of raising a family presented a new problem. He was so scared that he would pass this on to his children. Even though he was told many times, this isn't hereditary, your children won't get it, he couldn't relax. It was a very big relief that they were perfect. Wouldn't wish for anything better, they're great. While the children were birthmark free, Dave's malformation kept growing and there seemed to be no medical solution in sight. But then last year, all that changed when he came across Mr. Muir and his pioneering treatment. We prefer to treat uh, malformations in a non-surgical way. Uh, it's a scarless treatment and we um, utilize a drug that's called pleomycin. Pleomycin is a cancer drug. Uh, it's one of the older drugs and not used that often anymore. You get yourself comfy on that. Bleomycin is injected directly into the veins. It contains a chemical that irritates the abnormal blood vessels, causing the veins to shrink, reducing swelling and colour. Today, Dave's having his 12th treatment, and already it's had dramatic results. To be able to, to have a treatment that doesn't hurt as anywhere near as much as the other treatments I've had, and for it to have positive results is, is brilliant. Mr Muir's pioneering treatment has a 93% success rate and it's now being introduced into other hospitals across the UK. Meeting Mr Muir and having the treatment is one of the best things in my life at the moment. To do what he's doing, to change somebody's life like he is, it's, it's amazing. Hi. Yeah. Hello. How are you doing? Good, thanks. Okay, feeling yeah. back, back to normal. Yeah. He used to be really engorged around his mouth and lips and everywhere. It was really engorged with blood and, and it was a mess. Now it's gone. He's, how do you say it, normal. Dave will need several more doses of bleomycin to get the best long-term results, but already his future's looking much brighter. Oh, it makes you feel feel brilliant knowing that something's something's working is is amazing. It gives you some hope, really.